The St. Joseph Regional Seminary traces its beginning when the first Bishop of Haro, Most Reverend Mariano Quartero, O.P. D.D., established Seminario de San Vicente Ferrer in 1869. Historically, it was then the first and only seminary in Western Visayas. Purposely, it was a house of formation for high school, philosophy, and theology seminarians. From 1869 to 1975, the seminary was under the administration of Vincentian Fathers. After some time, Seminario de San Vicente Ferrer underwent a remarkable crisis. It resulted to a walkout that eventually led to a closure of its theology department. In September 3, 1976, St. Joseph Regional Seminary formally opened as a theological school with Most Reverend Alberto Piamonte, D.D., then Auxiliary Bishop of Haro, as its first rector. He formed the Episcopal Board consisting the Archbishop of Haro, Bishop of Capiz, Calibo, San Jose de Antique, Romblon, Bacolod, and Apostolic Vicariate of Palawan. After a year, Monsignor Josefino Ilidan took over the place of Bishop Piamonte as rector. And in the year 1978, Father Raul Martires succeeded Monsignor Ilidan until he was appointed as Bishop of San Jose de Antique. In the year 1983, Father Vicente Salgado was installed as rector and in his term, the Spiritual Pastoral Formation Year, or SPFY, was included in St. Joseph Regional Seminary Program, inserted between second and third years of theology. The SPFY Nazareth Balay Dilihunan Program was characterized by hidden and simple life in the community that sees the value of work and prayer as essential for formation. In 1988, Father Jose S. Palma assumed the office of the rector. During his term, his emphasis was on the physical improvement of the seminary. Father Joe Pal, as he was fondly called, also came up with more stabilized and unified approach to theological formation as envisioned by the Second Plenary Council of the Philippines. On November 28, 1997, Father Palma was appointed by Pope John Paul II as the Auxiliary Bishop of Cebu. The election of Father Palma was historical for St. Joseph Regional Seminary because he is the first alumnus to become a bishop. On the same year, Father Peter M. Correa, who was then the Dean of Studies, was installed as a rector. In his term, the academic program of St. Joseph Regional Seminary has been formalized. In 1999, the Propedeutic Year program was initiated for first-year theology seminarians with emphasis on psychological, human, and Christian formation as far as possible to its radical and ecclesial implications. On June 16, 2003, Reverend Father Jesus P. The Archdiocese of Haro was installed as the new rector. A memorandum of agreement was signed between St. Joseph Regional Seminary and University of San Agustin Iloilo for a consortium program for the Master of Arts in Religious Studies. In the year 2009, the seminary welcomed a new rector in the person of Reverend Monsignor Ramon M. Masculino Jr. 
During his rectorship, the Human Formation Program was intensified and the seminary rules and schedules were revisited. Moreover, Monsignor Peter M. Correa, H.P., introduced new approaches for a more integral seminary formation. It is the Tripodal Intervention Program, namely Spiritual Direction, Advising and Mentoring. In the year 2013, Very Reverend Midifil Billiones was installed as a rector. Under his rectorship, St. Joseph Regional Seminary has started the Propediotic Discernment Year after it was approved with the Episcopal Board. The program was drafted by the formators with Monsignor Peter M. Correa as the prime mover. The seminary has also undergone repairs on its facilities to heighten the suitability of the place for the formation. Alumni associations has been strengthened as they take part in the improvement and amelioration of seminary facilities and programs. This is St. Joseph Regional Seminary until Christ is formed in us, Donek Formetor Christus.